we in the ministry, we are innovating in bringing up some policies along with uh, the Brazilian uh, agricultural research enterprise, Embrapa, to develop uh, the scientific underpinnings of sustainable agriculture. Brazil is among the three top agricultural producers in the world. It has a very large area in agriculture, about 2.7 million square kilometers, mostly for producing uh, animal protein, mostly cattle, and about 0.7 million uh, kilometer, uh, square kilometers for uh, grains and other types of agriculture. So we need in Brazil to make the agri uh, Brazilian agriculture move towards sustainability. Sustainable agriculture uh, depends on changing the, the agricultural paradigm. So it's not the market dominated agriculture, it's an agriculture dominated by maximizing three functions. Food security for 100% of population in the world, making agriculture more resilient to, to climate and other global environmental changes, and also reducing the ecological footprint of agriculture, making agriculture uh, uh, less damaging to the climate, to biodiversity, Reducing emissions in agriculture is very important. And uh, so we have combined efforts between Ministry of Science, Technology, and Innovation, which is responsible for developing the methodologies, the research, the knowledge needed to reduce emissions, and the Embrapa. And uh, a new program emerged, which is called Low Carbon Agriculture in Brazil. Part of the program are being implemented in the field, increasing nitrogen fixation, uh, recovering degraded pasture land, which we have 2 million square kilometers of pasture land in Brazil, about one third degraded, uh, mixing up agriculture and cattle raising and pastures uh, with scientific uh, evidence on how to do it and also precision agriculture. So all those elements form this program, which is uh, it's been very successful, it has only two years of age, but certainly that's the way to make, to reduce uh, emissions from agriculture in Brazil.